Hey, I'm Bruce from Carolina Heritage um, Final Assembly. I'm going to show you how to put these locks in that we sent to you. Um, so these are the basic tools you're going to need. Uh, you'll need an adjustment, adjustable wrench or a uh, pair of channel locks, a three-quarter inch drill bit, a uh, paddle bit works best for us, um, whatever driver you're going to use to run your screws, the hateful latch clip that we sent to you, um, and these are all the components that came in the bag with the locks and then you'll need a speed square and a tape measure. Okay, so first off what we're going to do is we're going to measure from the top of the door to the inside of the case should be half inch from here to the inside of this case. Make sure that that is and that will help us. Okay. And then the next step is we're going to measure an inch and 11 sixteenths down from the top of the door. Okay, and then take your uh, speed square and make you a mark across. Okay, so then we're going to do an inch and a quarter from the inside of the door back, which will be there. make your mark okay then right at the point that the two lines intersect will be the center of our hole for our lock so we'll take our three-quarter paddle bit remember to only go halfway through so it pokes to the back so you don't tear it out be our lock hole. Okay, the lock is assembled. The key, you just put the key in. Drop the lock through the hole. Open the door. You have this little collar. Put the collar on it. Like so. And then you have your, your washer or your nut. Tighten that down. And this is where you'll need the adjustable wrench. Tighten this down. I'm just going to hand tighten it for now. Okay. So then you, for this application, we're going to use this bent, which is a small arm. Okay. You want to pay attention to how the lock is set in the cabinet. You want the key to be straight up and down in the cabinet. Okay. That'll be your locked position. Okay. That'll go on there just like that. Okay, and then uh, just put your bolt in. Tighten it down with your screwdriver. All right, and that's the assembly of the lock. Okay, so now for the set of the latch, which is the hardest part is to just follow this line straight onto the face of the cabinet. That'll give you the center of the lock. Measure from the inside of the door. See the mark I made right there? Okay. So measure from the inside of the door to the inside right here of the lock. And I got three quarters. Depending on the thickness of your bumper, you have to minus that. So, mine is an eighth, so I'm going to have to go five eighths. I will be measuring down five eighths in the cabinet. 
And this is just a rough estimate here. There's always adjustments. Um, turn the Hayfla clip like this. Line it up where you're covering the line in the center of this line. Make sure it's nice and straight. Shut the door. And there the door is locked.